From our roads to our buildings, much of what we have today is thanks to the Hawaiian monarchy. And Aloha Authentic Kamakapili shares some of the accomplishments of Hawaii's last prince. The last time you drove down the street, did you take note of the street name? Do you know that if you did, you could learn more about Hawaii and our history? On our weekly Aloha Authentic segment, we highlight various roadways across the islands so we can dig into those given names and in turn, learn something new. This week, we highlight the legacy of a man nicknamed the Prince of the People. On the island of Kauai, from the Ahupua'a of Kalapaki to the Ahupua'a of Haena, stands a main roadway named after a Hawaiian prince who became a U.S. congressman. We are talking about Kuhio Highway. Born from a line of Kauai kings, Jonah Kuhio Kalaniana'ole was named a prince at the young age of 13. While attending a military boarding school in California, Prince Kuhio and his brothers introduced the sport of surfing to America after sliding on waves with redwood planks in the mouth of the San Lorenzo River. As a statesman, Prince Kuhio is famous for the Hawaiian Homes Commission Act, which created the Hawaiian homelands. But his influence expands further. Our current county system across the state was influenced by the prince, establishing the counties of Hawaii, Maui, Oahu, and Kauai in 1905. Interestingly, the county of Oahu was changed to the city and county of Honolulu two years later. It was the royal congressman who secured the funds for the construction of Pearl Harbor. And despite being against the kingdom's overthrow, Prince Kuhio was the first person to sponsor a bill for Hawaii's statehood in 1919, 40 years before Hawaii officially became the 50th state. Did you know? Now you do.